anchors away from Newport, one of the friendliest cities on the magnificent Oregon coast. You're watching PD Exposed, and I'm your host, John Olson. On this episode, we'll take you to some of the districts that make Newport one of the premier travel destinations in all of Oregon. And I might even kiss a sea lion on the lips. The fun starts now. The historic Bayfront is home to the largest fishing fleet in the state of Oregon. Several barking sea lions, lots of great restaurants, quaint shops, pubs with live music. There's something for everybody. It's a perfect place for a family to spend an afternoon. Moe's is actually a tourist attraction in this town, isn't it? It actually started out as a, as a place for locals, and uh, we didn't even serve seafood in the beginning, you know, because we were serving the fishermen and the longshoremen and the loggers, and the last thing they really wanted to eat was seafood. They wanted, like, their steaks and their burgers and their spaghetti and this type of thing. So now you're famous for your chowder. Yes. And it goes way beyond just Oregon, right? We do uh, second day FedEx shipping uh, fresh, our fresh base, so that's really nice. So it arrives at your door cold and ready to be put in a pot as your own milk. I met Cindy a couple years ago and I asked her what the secret was to this fancy chowder that goes all over the world now. And she, she told me, so I just want to see if it's the same secret. Uh, yes. <laughs> She didn't tell me. I was trying to get you to say you might tell me. Talk about Newport. This is a great town. It's very friendly. This town is wonderful. I was born and raised here. I went to high school here. Um, of course, I've been all over the world, and I always just can't wait to get back to Newport. We're, it's a very special community because not only are we a tourist attraction with beautiful beaches and the Marine Science Center and the aquarium and the beautiful bridge, but we're a working bayfront, so it kind of adds a little charm, a little something different than your typical beach town. We have all that, the fishing fleet, you know, you can see fish come in and the crab and go down to the boats and buy your own stuff. And um, so that really, I think, and, uh, lends a really nice aspect to our town. 